Hello, hello. Good morning. We are doing day four of the Compass Leads the Way meditation. I hope yesterday you already found your groove. You found on YouTube. I've taped already a few evening meditations. So you have your variety. I've gotten so many comments that they're loving that I'm showing my personality. Um... Because those of you who know me for a very long time know that I love to play Oz. And I like to stay behind the camera. But now you're starting to see who I am. So, saging all of you. Saging myself. Saging my beautiful book. Because you always want to start your day clear and clean. Day four. Day four I start introducing you to um, the very first Yama. Right, which is uh, ahimsa, nonviolence. So that can be your mantra today: ahimsa, ahimsa, ahimsa. For those who are still not comfortable with Sanskrit, you can move to uh, the English version. English affirmations would be: "I am committed to nonviolence." That's a nice one. I'm committed to nonviolence. You can also use. I'm bringing in more love, compassion, and peace in my life. I am bringing in much more love, peace, and compassion in my life. I am bringing more love, peace, compassion into my life. Or I'm open to, right? Um, the other energetic way you can do is just, I give love. I offer love. I give love. I offer love. Because that energy is actually opposite of violence. What you're trying to do is avoid violent thoughts, violent actions, violent speech, right? So even your, even what you're seeing, right? What you're seeing on social media and TV, the news, sometimes can be very violent and jarring to you. And then what happens is you stay with that energy. So ahimsa is so himsa the word himsa means violence and whenever you put the a before the, the the sanskrit word it means the opposite so that's why it's non-violence so you just want to bring that softness into your body into your dialogue into everything that you kind of do today so when you chant ahimsa ahimsa you're bringing non-violence non-violence Nonviolence. So today, beyond this meditation, if you feel that you're feeling very aggressive, um, angry, resentful, take a moment, take a time out, go take a walk, go sit in your car, you know, sit someplace else and just <sighs> take a breath and just, just chant ahimsa, 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 or I'm giving love. I'm bringing in more peace, compassion. And love into my life. Like bring in that opposite energy. Okay. So that's today. Day four. But today was a bonus. I gave you two. Those who know the big great mantra. Loka Samasta Sukino Bhavantu. Is uh, translated. in may all beings everywhere be happy and free. And may my thoughts, words, actions of my own life contribute in some way to the happiness, peace, ease, and freedom from all, for all. So this mantra takes you out of your own mind from the personal and self-thoughts and out of your own headspace into, again, that energy of peace, sending it out, giving love and peace outward. That's why I gave you both versions today. It's really fun, really nice. So loka means location, realm, all the universes that are in existence right now. Samasta, all beings sharing the same location. Sukino means energy centered in happiness and joy, freedom from suffering. Bhava means the divine state of unified connectedness and existence. And Antu means may it be so. So, Loka Samasta Sukino Bhavantu. That could also be chanted. It could also be sung. There's a few pretty songs out there that do that one as well. So you choose which one you want. If you want, I will bring you through both 
for the next few moments. So just sit tight. We've got another few more moments to sit for our meditation. That was the quick intro and lecture. And let us begin. So if you haven't sat down already, hopefully you've been sitting down. And going forward, as I lecture and speak with you, you should be sitting and just listening and taking in all the knowledge as you're already in your meditative space and breathing. Ahimsa. 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 Loka Samasta Sukino Bavantu Loka Samasta Sukino Softening in your heart center, riding the wave. Bring your hands to your heart center. And again, your choice. See it with an om or an ah. Take a deep inhale. And that is day four from The Compass Leads the Way. I hope you enjoyed today's meditation. Remember, finish off your top and now your bottom. Write down the observations of how today's meditation went. Any observations, experiences, observances. Excellent. See you soon. Bye-bye.